I went over there and sure as anything, it was gone. The whole bridge was just like, there was nothing there. And I started recording. I was like, I can't believe this. I was just, it's, it's a shocking sight to see because you've lived your whole life here and you've seen this thing your entire life. And then one day you go outside and it's not there. Someone crashed into the fucking Bay Bridge. There's cops everywhere. I'm at my job. And there's police all up and down the fucking bridge, yo. That shit is crazy, dude. My entire cart, it's like a about a three foot cart and it's made of metal. The whole thing shook. So I thought I had hit something. I thought I hit maybe a pallet jack piece or some debris on the ground and then I asked a few other co-workers like did y'all just feel that and everybody was like yeah man that was hard that was like hard rumbling thunder we don't know what it was so two o'clock rolls around we go out on break mind you it's very dark outside but we have a perfect view of the bridge in the videos and photos I sent you or the video and photos I sent you you can see like you can see the bridge even though it's dark out my co-worker goes Jay look the bridge collapsed and I was like, you're lying. Stop playing with me. He goes, no, go look. I still am kind of in shock. Like, it's <laughs> it's just unfortunate that it happened, too, because everybody was telling us that a cargo ship hit the, hit the support beams, and we couldn't even see a ship. Like, we didn't see anything in the water. All we seen was the debris of the bridge and the support beams. So we had no idea that 